the most patient man on television endures the American public. I don't know what's going on in this world right now. Obama's a Muslim, and that's all I got to say. Obama is not a Muslim, but thank you for making your comment. I watch all three of your channels, C-SPAN, C-SPAN 1, and C-SPAN 2, uh, C-SPAN 3, I'm sorry. Sure. And it, it's heavily Republican. Okay. Uh, I thought this was a free country. We've excluded God from everything, and look at what's happening to us. We should probably send in special forces, similar to Rambo. I don't know enough about the military. Just scare them off, tell them off, I'll blow your head off, and that's all. That's done. Okay. Having our government do absolutely nothing. It's treason. Okay. That's what brings us to idiocracy. Okay. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. Now, the continuing adventures of the most patient man on television. You can hear me? I can. Go ahead, Paul. Uh, this is uh, this is uh, Little Beach speaking. You're on the air. Go ahead. Blacks need to take a little bit more responsibility for themselves. This government has a habit of putting labels on people. Uh, Jap, Kraut, Indian, VC. Brutish, brainless, bloated, blackmailing, bribing, boondogging, bamboozling, bureaucracy. The Zionist neocon Jews are behind all of this. The Jews that run the, the media. The Jews are great people. It's just only the big time ones that control all the finances here in America. I'm not prejudiced. I'm not racist. I'm not sexist. And I'm not a hater. We need to get rid of every Muslim out of the country because they are sent here to kill us. Okay, we'll leave it at that.